Hey guys, it's Dan again. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, so since my last update of this uh, anniversary update of my tank, uh, one of the viewers, Saltwater Beginners, uh, mentioned that the problem that I was having with this uh, overgrowth of uh, something that I didn't know before is called Aptasia. And uh, so in the beginning when it first appeared in the tank, I thought it was just a little uh, growth of some sort of organism in there and my roommate said it might be a pest that I should take it out but I didn't uh, want to because I thought it was kind of mean to kill it so um, I let it stay and it started to spread everywhere over the tank and it looks like it's, it's, it's uh, going to be spreading even more it's going to be totally out of control so I looked up online and also went to my local fish store here and they recommend to try out uh, peppermint shrimp. Uh, there's a few other fish that may, uh, may eat this so that will clear the tank of uh, its growth. Uh, one of them is the copper band butterfly. But uh, I'm gonna try this peppermint shrimp first. So today I went to the local fish store and I got, I got six peppermint shrimp. That are in there. I'm gonna acclimate it to the tank for a little bit and release them and I'll be right back. So guys here's the bag with the six peppermint shrimp in in there. Uh, it looks translucent at the moment but uh, when I saw the pet shop it might it has like a little color to it so hopefully that will come about after it gets comfy with the tank. Uh, so these shrimp cost eight dollars each uh, but they had a special where if you get five, you get one for free. So this bag of shrimp costs 40 bucks. Um, so I'm hoping that uh, eventually it try to get rid of as much as it can. If not, I may have to use some sort of chemicals and lemon juice to kill it as they recommend it online. Uh, so I'm going to let this sit for a while and then once I release it, I'll give you guys an update. Hey guys. So it's been a little while since I acclimated the uh, peppermint shrimp into the tank uh, and I released them just now and it looks like it's trying to get accustomed to the environment. Um, I actually, there were six in the bag and when I released them and I try to pay attention to it, uh, I only see five so the other one is hiding somewhere. Uh, so hopefully they, once they get adjusted, they can start get to work. On eliminating this abstasia uh, issue that I'm having and uh, from what I learned from the uh, uh, woman at the pet uh, shop she said that uh, they work in groups so what happens is uh, they all would work together to try to attack the abstasia and because the abstasia keeps stinging them so having one or two in the tank won't be effective because it will get, get stung uh, quickly and the uh, they won't be able to get to eating it. Uh, so when they work together, they will have a higher chance of, of uh, eating the abstasia. I'm going to try these first and uh, eventually if it's still an issue, I may consider getting a copper band butterfly, but uh, if you watch my previous videos, I actually had a copper band uh, uh, butterfly fish. Uh, that didn't do well in the tank. Uh, so if uh, this issue is still ongoing, I may want to do that or eventually use chemicals to try to rid of this overgrowth of abstasia. So uh, thanks Saltwater Beginner for letting me know what type of problems I was having because uh, I didn't really do much research about it because I thought that it would subside and uh, it won't be an issue but it looks like uh, you know, if I don't do something to it, it will get worse. So, I will update you guys in a week or two or even a little bit longer if I don't see that much progress to let you know how the peppermint shrimp, uh, the, uh, you know how the peppermint shrimp do to the, the substation. Thanks for watching and Happy New Year. Uh, today is the 30th and I'm sorry, today is, um, yeah, it is the 30th. Uh, tomorrow's going to be New Year's Eve, so I hope you guys have a wonderful uh, 2019, and I'll keep you guys up to date more. Have a good night. Bye.